Hi everyone, I am going to be showing you how to make another aquarium nail and in this tutorial I will be using straws. I have two different sizes of straws here. I use the larger straw right here. This felt heavier on my finger. I could actually feel this and I had people ask me that question a lot. Do you feel that on your finger? Does it feel heavy? No, I could not feel it on my finger. I didn't even know it was there. That was until I made this technique and yeah, I could feel it. But I think if I would have made the nail maybe shorter and with the smaller sized straws, I think it wouldn't have felt so heavy. But you know, you live and learn and I think the technique is great here. You shorten the nail bed glue that right there that's why you want to have a little lip of brush on nail glue the next thing you need is just some hard builder gel why I have that space there it's to plug up the tank and also so that the straw won't be sitting on your fingertip this for two minutes to take the straw out. You can see it lifting. I took a needle tool. I lifted all the way around. Dork scissors here and I just cut the straw all the way down. It just released itself. Put another layer of gel on top. cure this 90 seconds. I'm going to focus on building that up a little bit more. Cure this now. Clean the outside of the nail because it has a sticky layer on it and I'm going to clean the inside. Now I need to plug up the bottom of the tank right here, the back of a form. IBD Intense Seal and the reason that I use IBD Intense Seal is that there is no sticky layer left. It is tack free and also it is a hard gel. Spread it out into a circle. I cure that 30 seconds. I have some IBD Intense Seal on my tile. And I take that little dollop of gel that I made and I'm going to stick it right in there. Cure that in place for about 30 seconds. I come in with the IBD gel and quickly flash cure it into place so that I can seal that bottom of the tank up. Now I'm going to make the top for the aquarium nail. I won't put it on until we fill the aquarium nail. Cure that for 30 seconds. And in the center here, you want to drill a hole. Time to seal in our tank. Put this top on and put the hole right in the center. And I'm going to stick it under the lamp and hold it like this and cure it. Let's go around under it here, seal it in more and cure it. Take a little piece of tape. I'm going to plug up that hole so that I can do some filing around the perimeter here where we sealed it and not get dust inside the tank. And once you get this filed, you add builder gel to it now, and that'll strengthen it up. I cleaned and I buffed that last bit of builder gel that I put around the tank. We're going to fill it with oil. Before I top coat this nail, I'm going to draw on the back side of the nail. 